Next thing I wanted to talk about is vitamin D. How is vitamin D good for our cardiovascular health, right? Isn't that just good for our bones and our immune system so we can kill off bugs and stay healthy there? Yeah, it's good for that, but it also is very important on keeping calcium out of our bloodstream and making it go to the right places. We don't want it to go to our blood vessels implant there. We want it to go to our bones. So vitamin D helps have it happen, and that's why we always want to do what? We want to take vitamin D with K2. So when I'm saying vitamin D, I always take it with K2. I never take it alone. It's D3, K2 blend. Get vitamin D. We don't have calcium that's going to be breaking down from our bones and going into the bloodstream. When we take D3, K2 helps shuttle it right to our bones, keeps it healthy, keeps it out of our blood vessels. Also, vitamin D helps modulate our immune response. It is the hormone that keeps our immune system healthy. It's, I don't know why it's called vitamin. It's more like a hormone. We should call it hormone of D. But it's really good on keeping the inflammatory state under control. So it decreases that inflammation of the blood vessel. So it's not as sticky and not as much cholesterol in the as are able to bind to the, uh, the blood vessel or a clot in the future.